ManyChat has just changed the way that you make sales on Instagram forever because you can now say hi to new followers and send a one-time welcome DM through Meta's official API on Instagram. This has never been seen before and you're now allowed to do outreach to new followers completely on autopilot. Now this has been in beta for a couple of months and I've been using it since the very beginning and in today's video I'm going to show you exactly how to set it up as well as how you can track the reply rates for different variations of your outreach message so that you can improve your efforts over time and get more replies. We're going to be doing this using two different tools. The first one obviously being ManyChat and the second being DM Tracker, which allows you to track the reply rate to your outreach messages, as well as see when you need to do follow-ups for every single lead and never forget any of them again. Both ManyChat and DM Tracker have a free trial. So if you don't have them yet, the links are going to be down below in the description to sign up. Now inside of ManyChat, the first thing you need to do is click on settings. Instagram and find the say hi to new followers section. Now, first you're gonna have to click on set up and this may show you a pop-up asking you to refresh your Instagram permissions. If it does, just go ahead and follow those steps. If not, then you're all good to go. It's gonna bring you to this page. Now we're not gonna be using this setup. So all we're gonna do is just put in something random such as test down here, click on go live in the top right hand corner. And once we're on this page, we're gonna click on the three dots in the top right hand corner and click on switch to flow. Builder. This is going to bring us to the classic flow builder that we know and love. And all we need to do is click on the trigger and turn it off because we're not going to be using what it shows right here. We're simply going to delete the two nodes that we see over here. And we now have a clean flow that we can start building out. Now, this is what it's going to look like once it's done. And you can access this template for free in the description. So simply join our school community at school.com slash Omnifusion. It's completely free and find the template in there. And once you've imported the template, you're going to see exactly what I see on screen right here. You're going to go ahead and click on edit on this automation. And what we're going to do now is click on the first node, hold down shift and click on all the different nodes to highlight them all together. Once we've highlighted all of these nodes, we're simply going to do command C on Mac or control C on Windows to copy everything and go back to the automations tab. Here, we're going to find the say hi to new followers automation that we just set up. We're going to click on that. We're going to click on edit, which is going to bring us to this page. Now we're going to paste it in. And now we have the entire flow inside our user follows your account trigger. We're going to connect the first node to this randomizer. And essentially what's happening here is we have three different messages that we're randomly going to select to new followers. And we're going to track everything inside of the M tracker, which I'm going to show you in a second, as well as send out the message. This allows us to know which message performs the best and allows to replace bad performing ones with new tests, as well as understand who we need to follow up with over time. Now, before we get into the juicy part of actually setting it up and trying it out, you need to make sure that you set up the M tracker and complete the onboarding. Once you've completed the onboarding for the M tracker and it's very self explanatory, you're going to be in this page. You're going to be able to see all of your contacts. You're going to be able to see your outreach messages. As you can see, all the outreach messages here are being tracked along with who it added it as well as which outreach message it is. And you can track all of your follow-ups in a follow-up board and see who you need to follow up with over time. And most importantly, your statistics. You're gonna be able to see how many outreach messages you send, what your reply rate is, what the reasons are for what you're sending outreach messages for, as well as the messages you're using and the reply rates by message. Now, how to use the M tracker itself is a whole different story. And all you need to do is click on this widget in the bottom right hand corner, click on help. And here you can find all the guides and articles on how to use the M tracker itself. In this video, we're going to be focusing specifically on DMing new followers for this. If you've already set up the M tracker, you're not going to need to do this, but I'm just going to show you anyways. All you need to do is click on settings click on connections. And here we're going to need to copy the DM tracker authentication token and the organization ID in order for the tracking to work. So we're going to copy the authentication token, go back into many chat, go to settings, fields. And in the top, we're going to select bot fields. There's going to be a folder saying imported from DM tracker. And here we're going to first replace the authentication token, paste it in, go back to DM tracker, copy the organization ID 
and we're going to paste in the organization ID into this field right here so that the DM tracker organization ID and authentication token are linked. Now, this means that we can officially track everything that's going on. We're going to go back into the automation, which is say hi to new followers. We can also rename it new follower outreach plus tracking. We're going to click on edit to see the current version that we're working on. And in here, we can now start to adjust our messages. So the first thing you're going to do is adjust the message that you want to send. So for this, you're simply going to click on this first box. And this is the new follower outreach one. So this is the first message we want to use. And we can say, hey, how are you? How is your training going at the moment? So this could be the first outreach message that we want to split test. The second one we can adjust right here, which is, hey, thanks for the follow, how's training going? And the third one is just how's it going? Or you can add any message that you want. So you can split test different variations of your message. Just adding this in here, when you add the messages to these different options, so when you add the different split test messages, you need to make sure you add the same exact message inside of the M tracker. So you would simply copy out the message from right here, go into the M tracker, go to settings, and in the settings, there is the outreach section where we have predefined reasons where new follower is part of this reason. And then we have message templates. So you could simply add a message template, new follower outreach one, add in the exact message, click on add message, go back here and do the same thing for number two and number three. So simply copy it again, add it in, call it new follower outreach to add in the message at the template and do that for all three messages. And anytime you change one of the messages here, you need to do the same process so that it can be accurately tracked so that it can be accurately tracked in your statistics. Now there's nothing really for you to do on these nodes, because this is going to use the variable that you set up here. So these nodes are going to be the only ones where you need to adjust the message. We need to adjust it here because inside of this node, we send the information to DM tracker so that everything is fully tracked and we can understand the reply rates. Now for this, all you need to do is click on the action, click here, and there's nothing for you to change here except for your email. So you will have to enter the email that you're using with DM tracker in order for this to work. Everything else is going to work automatically. So simply change your email here, click on the second one and do the same thing. Click on body, change the email, click on save, click on the third one, click here, click on body, change your email and click on save. Once you've done that, it's going to be fully functional. Meaning when somebody follows you, there's going to be a randomizer. It's going to pick one of these different messages. It's going to track it in the M tracker, and it's going to send the message to that lead. Now we can go ahead and click on update here, which is going to save everything and immediately turn it live. If you don't want it live, you can come back in into the trigger and actually turn off the trigger just so that we can keep it deactivated in case you need more time to, to track everything. And something very important is to actually complete the regular onboarding of the M tracker so that it understands when replies come in. This is going to be done through a default reply flow, but the entire onboarding is explained once you sign up to the free trial inside of DM Tracker. Now we're going to go ahead and test this in real time. So I'm going to turn on the trigger, which means that this is now live. I'm going to take out my phone and I'm going to start to trigger this out. So I'm going to go into Instagram. I'm going to find the account that is linked to this many chat, which in this case is a burner account of mine. I'm going to find the account. As you can see, I don't follow it yet. This will not work if you already follow the account, you unfollow it and you follow it again. It's not gonna trigger, it's only for brand new followers. I'm gonna go ahead and click on follow. Boom, so I've now followed the account. We've set up here that there's a waiting time. So there's a delay automation, wait one minute. So one minute after the follow is when we're gonna send it. You can also adjust this. So simply click on the trigger, click here and adjust the wait time to immediate 30 seconds, one minute, five minutes, 10 minutes, whatever you want to do. In this case, it's one minute by default. 
And all we need to do now is go to the live chat, click on all. Sometimes you may have to refresh to see this. And we're going to pick this one where Sada, my business partner, just sent a message. It randomly picked the new follower outreach three message inside of the automation, sent the message to the lead after following. And now if we go into the M tracker and we go to outreach, we can see that Sada was added because he's a new follower by me, because I put my email into the note earlier with the message, how's it going? And the message is tracked exactly as what we sent here. Now, inside of the M tracker, if we go to statistics and we select the time range today, we're going to be able to see I did two tests and we have two outreaches. Both of them are to new followers. And we sent this message right here. In my case, it's archived. In your case, this will not show up in that way. You're going to be able to see the exact message, whether it's message one, two, or three. And you're going to be able to see which one is performing best. I'm going to be making another video very soon where I'm going to show you exactly the system that I personally use, where we go way beyond this and actually scrape the profile of the person who followed us and write a personalized outreach message to that specific lead. I'm going to go over that in one of the next videos. So if you don't want to miss it, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel so that you get notified when that video comes out. And if you want to learn more on how some of our clients make $400,000 per month with the AI sales system on Instagram, Instagram, click the link down below in the description and schedule in a call with my business partner.